presently, I'm sitting in the conference room waiting to have a one-on-one -on -one interview with the CEO of the Atlanta Hawks, Steve Conan. So I'm very excited. When I started at Coca-Cola, I was a very young guy, and I had a tremendous amount of success in thinking different and acting different and using creativity as a currency. So created lots of different ideas, worked on the Coke polar bear campaign, wrote lots of commercials, and did things differently. One of the things that I was dissatisfied, one of the few things, is I wanted to run a P&L. When you're in marketing, you're always the L in a P&L. And um, there was an opportunity at Turner to go run P the P&L. So in 2000, I moved over from Coca-Cola to Turner. A lot of the management principles were the same. It's asset management, it's leadership of people, it's strategy. And so I started on TNT and then got the whole portfolio of Turner Entertainment Networks over time and had a fabulous time and, and had a tremendous amount of success, our team did. And about this time last year, in the spring last year, I was approached to help find somebody. And I thought it might be a great fit for me. And then I was, I was thinking the average tenure of a network president is 42 months, and I had done it for 14 years. So I was thinking that um, I'd like to do something civic. I'd like to do something in the community. I, my family's been in Atlanta for almost 90 years. And I think a, a sports team can unify a city and draw people together and be an economic engine for downtown Atlanta. So that was what was appealing and that's why I came. Steve Poonin was such a great guy. Um, um, it, it was definitely worth going out and, and, and getting him. Um, everything you see, video clips, is, is it's true in person. Um, he, he's a great guy, and uh, I look forward to potentially working with him. Um, I'm definitely going to keep uh, my eyes open for potential positions within the organization.